Hannah and Abigail left a, me uh, a letter to Grandma. Our earliest memories of you were filled with joy, laughter, delicious food, and lots of love. Coming out to Portland was, and still is, a treat for us. The distance is far and the flight is long, but we know we always had the tightest hug waiting for us in the doorway. In the mornings, you'd fill us up with a breakfast feast, which fueled us for the days we spent fishing or swimming or just being kids with our wonderful cousins. We had great memories of playing bingo, or more recently, categories with the family at night, laughing until our jet lag sent us to bed. <laughs> we loved going to the Rhinelander with you, <coughs> watching Jeopardy with you, you got me hooked, <laughs> and playing with all the pets on, the, on, the, on your carpet as we watched you from your big red chair. You always listened to our stories when we came home from stories and pictures. At one time, airbrush tattoos. That was at Saturday Park. <laughs> she said she'd take her out of the will if we got tattoos. <laughs> they were just airbrush. Huh? She didn't try to scratch their <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but we couldn't be there, so we managed to, we managed to stay in touch. They talked a lot. Um, some of the best days of mine at college this past year were the days I got a giant package that she would send. And uh, she would call as soon as she opened it. Uh, it was always filled with the most delicious cookies and my favorite candies. One of those, or you, you were one of the very few who remembered all my favorites. Around holidays, you sent decorations for my entire residence hall and brightened everyone's day. Some of the most memorable decorations came from Christmas. The, the Santa toilet cover, <laughs> the snowflakes for the wall, and the solar-powered elves that tick side to side. I was, I was the envy of everyone with my fun and truly thoughtful packages of Grandma Jo. And I can't forget the cheese, which got to be in high demand amongst my friends at school. Abigail still insists on constantly having having in our refrigerator in New York. You were so thoughtful and so loving, and we were lucky to have you as our grandmother. We're grateful for having had a chance to know you for 17 and 19 years. Thank you so much for everything you did. We love you, Grandma. We love Hannah and Abigail. Yeah, she... Uh, she loved to entertain. She would love this party. Loved to cook uh, to the end. She was. I was I tried to get her to stop doing the big dinners because it was too right. her out. Yep. Just for days. But uh, she just had. To, and that was what she did. She loved it. And then. And then about two weeks ago, her kitchen aide mixer died. One week before she died. Weird, huh? <laughs> anyway, thanks for coming. Uh, big thank you to my wife for putting this thing together. A lot of work. Mm -hmm. All the help we got. Thank you. I don't know.